Hello guys and welcome back to the channel. Thanks for joining me. I'm just saying my piece and uh, today we are going to do something uh, a little different. Uh, as well, we like to talk about building our dream house in Jamaica. Many people and indeed many times people build a nice house and uh, one of the things that they do not take into consideration is the fact that uh, your dream house so to speak does not uh, it is not just the house it is your environment in other words the landscaping that goes around your house and all the other things such as um, you may want to plant a garden or you may want to plant fruit trees in fact uh, many of us having lived abroad for some time we tend to forget one of the selling points of houses in Jamaica and that is the phrase that the phrase that always goes well fruited uh, yeah I know many of you forgot that phrase well fruited that is one of the great selling points of any property in Jamaica it has to be well fruited now we are going to uh, plant an orchard today well we are going to be preparing the ground showing you where I'm going to be putting in this little orchard and uh, just for the record I have 16 different types of fruit trees that I am going to plant over the next couple of days but today I am going to show you where I am going to plant them and what the fruit trees are so stand by guys okay so to give you a bit of perspective this is where the house is as you can see it's a little unfinished at the moment there is a second story to be added here but um, this would be technically the, the right hand side of the house now let's do a little bit of identification here and this is my mother's little um, flower garden and as you can see there's a wall right here it's temporary and over in this section where you can see the canes and so on that is going to be removed but behind it is a guava tree now this here is an apple tree and right behind it is a star apple tree over there in the background that long one that you can see that is an aki tree and right here that is a mango tree now the idea being that since there are already a bunch of fruit trees and so on here and by the way the, this other tree beside it that is a sour sap tree now the idea being that since this piece of land is fairly large and fairly level i am going to plant all the and let's let me take a quick walk through here this is where we would plant all the fruit trees so the idea being that we would plant them all in a grid pattern a nice grid pattern to make it easier for maintenance and of course it would be aesthetically pleasing in other words when you look at it it should look nice you know so that is the idea now uh, there are already a few avocado trees planted here and we do have a shorty coconut tree that is planted right here now this will have to be removed because plants have changed and this area will at some point become a covered garage of course these banana trees will have to go as well but the idea being that this entire section here will become a manicured orchard and that's where we are at the moment now again we already have some avocado trees planted and here is another one that has just been planted and as you can see it is a bit cultivated but that is really not much of an issue so that's where we are at the moment now i am going to take you and show you the plants that i have bought 
All right, so what we have here are a number of plants, 16 different types of plants, as a matter of fact, of fruit trees. You can see they are all in their little, um, their little jackets, so to speak. So let us start from here, show you what I have. This one here is something called peanut butter fruit. That would be this one. This one is jimbling. This is jimbling. This one here is a cashew plant. This is a nutmeg plant. This is an East Indian mango. And honestly, I cannot remember what this one was, but I think it's a mami. And this is an ice cream bean plant. This is a mami apple plant. This is a mandarin. This is Neesberry. This is a cherry tree. This one is a plum. Um, I, I cannot remember what that one was to be perfectly honest. And this one is a tamarind. So anyway, as I under, as if I recall correctly, it's 16 different plants. I'll have to go and look at my little record of what I had here. So these are what we are going to put in the orchard. And I do have plans for quite a few more. And uh, that will be it for now, guys. So thanks for watching. Thank you very much for subscribing to the channel. And those who have not subscribed, let me tell you, if you don't subscribe, you will not get to find out what a peanut butter fruit is. So, <laughs> so again, thanks for watching and don't forget to like and subscribe. You all have a great day.